after the fall of Manila in 1942. Filipino and American officials tried to devise ways to keep the Philippine National Treasury out of the enemy's hands. At the time, it was brimming with millions worth of assets, from cash to gold and silver bullions. After recording the serial numbers, 20,500,000 peso bills were burned from January 19 to 20. When a U.S. submarine arrived in Corregidor on February 3, workers loaded it with golds and silver bars to be shipped to San Francisco. With little time left, the government decided to dump the remaining silver coins worth millions of pesos into Caballo Bay just off the coast of Corregidor. The Japanese learned about the sunken treasure right after the fall of Corregidor, so they sought the help of Filipino and American divers, of whom many drowned, to salvage the silver coins with little success. Almost 80 years after the war, many of the coveted silver coins are still under the sea, waiting to